Ambassador Ann Wagner of Missouri. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I'd like to first state my strong support for all of the bills that we are marking up uh, today, but I want to speak uh, specifically in support of House Resolution 311, the, the resolution that I was honored to introduce with my colleague, uh, Representative Castro, to commemorate ASEAN's uh, 50th anniversary and the 40th anniversary of U.S.-ASEAN relations. Southeast Asia has tremendous cultural, political, historical, and religious diversity. ASEAN was formed in part to create a bulwark uh, against communism in Southeast Asia among these diverse nations. Today, ASEAN's goals have evolved and the region is experiencing tremendous growth. Nearly $100 billion of U.S. goods and services are exported to the ASEAN, rivaling our $113 billion market in China. In January, I founded the Bipartisan Congressional Caucus on ASEAN with my friend and colleague, Congressman Castro. The caucus acknowledges America's special relationship with ASEAN and is pushing Congress forward in strengthening engagement in Southeast Asia. House Resolution 311 was one of our first initiatives, and the resolution encourages the enhancement of economic and defense cooperation with ASEAN. It reaffirms the U.S. commitment to continue joint efforts with ASEAN to halt human smuggling and human trafficking and urges ASEAN to improve assistance to refugees and migrants. I'm grateful that the chair and ranking member are strong supporters of this effort, and I look forward to next seeing this resolution on the House floor. I thank you, Mr. Chairman, and I yield back. 